Wow, how to turn tables. Team keep it clean. I think the only thing that Lamar may be sick of was only being a father of one child. Because it looks like he had baby number two. So that would explain this random sickness that he just so happened to get that John Harbaugh talked about. Um, and again, he did say Lamar, he wanted to practice, he tried to get to practice, but he couldn't make it to practice. Maybe he was saying that because of the, the timing of the birth uh, of uh, the baby. Maybe, maybe that was it. But um, if this is the case, congratulations again uh, to Lamar Jackson. That, that man is really, uh, apparently, he really starting a family. Like, he, he ain't playing around, boy, but uh, Wow. Um, that's definitely a, uh, a change of events. You know, it, it's funny because if this is the case, it's funny how things can change like that. Um, so many people, uh, they just continue to speak ill, uh, no pun intended there, but to speak ill of his immune system saying, oh, this and that. I, I, I saw somebody even say, oh, well, they, this is another reason why Lamar Jackson does deserve the money. Because he's always sick. And I just, it, it's, it's crazy with how, like with, with a football player, professional football player, obviously these guys, a lot of their lives are on public display 24-7. Um, uh, and it is hard for them to have any sort of privacy. Um, because it's always something going on. And, and, and everything that happens with them, a lot of it gets publicly documented and whatnot. Their, their pay the hours that they work, their, their performance, everything is on public display. But um, so with that, like with, with Lamar Jackson, with his, him, whenever they say he's sick, and there have been times when he has been sick, this time it seems like he's just using his sick time. But anyway, whenever in the past, whenever they've said he's sick, um, it's usually once a year, sometimes twice, but usually once a year around the same time every year. And there are a lot of people that get frustrated with that. There are a lot of people that get really upset with that. And I'm thinking like, man, I guess these people, they just never get sick. They never get sick. They never get colds. They never get anything. I mean, it was a, a virus going around. And, um, and, and a lot of people were catching that virus. Uh, but when Lamar caught that virus... That's when everybody was like, oh, man, he's, or not everybody, but a lot of people were like, oh, man, this guy, he's always sick and he's irresponsible, this and that and the third. And it's just weird. Um, I, I feel like a lot of people, when it comes to just a lot of stuff, not even just with Lamar Jackson, but when, if people put themselves in other people's shoes, then I feel like people's thought process would be so much better. And I feel like a lot would just run a lot smoother. If we put ourselves in other people's shoes, instead of just looking at somebody like, oh, man, they should have done this or they shouldn't have done that or they, they need to do this or they need. Put yourself in their shoes. Try to put yourself in their situation. I know a lot of times it can be hard because you can't always relate to everybody. But I feel like if people at least tried to, then things would be just so much better. Um, but anyway, shout out to Lamar. Um, if this is the case that he did have uh, another child. Congrats. So just like Lamar is when it came to uh, practice today, but apparently it's for a very, very good reason. We out.